Roger. <coughs> phone. No, for a phone. phone. No, for my dude. My console already has almost eight terabytes. It's fine the way it is. <laughs> a lot of memes. And pro and possibly a lot of uh sub. Oh, there's a uh, a hundred and. I'm trying to get used to the. You know how phones have a feature where they take away the buttons, so you can get used to like doing shit without clicking the button. Yeah. There's no button that it wakes it up and then you unlock it. Mm -hmm. Okay. One thing I don't understand the difference is between Sandisk Ultra and Sandisk Extreme. I beat my wife. I beat your wife too. Oh, this is an interesting. Oh, but damn, I don't know this brand. Have you ever heard of a brand called Micro Sensor? <coughs> yeah, I know Sandisk and Samsung, and then there's an. I think the the other one that I. Yeah, they have a good one. I forgot. There's another one that they that there's another big brand. It starts with an E, I think. Is it Eva? I forgot what it's called. Shut up. No. Okay, so basically between our if a Santis 128 gigabyte Extreme Pro versus the 128 gigabyte Ultra SD, uh, the the Extreme has a read speed of 95 megabytes a second and a write speed of 90 megabytes per second. The Ultra is 80 for the read speed and the write speed is at 10 10 minimum. Well, it's, it's only specified as 10 minimum. No, the, uh, the extreme is 95 for reading. Yeah, 95, 90. And ultra is 80 and, and for the write speed. It only says, it's only specified as minimum 10. Never knew the difference between the ultra and extreme. Okay. Nope. One's reading, one's writing. I can't read. Actually, pretty surprised by how cheap the 128 gigabyte is. It's only for the extreme. It's only 25 bucks. I think I have that on my old phone. Let me see how much the 256 gig. It is 52.49. I'm do. That happened with one phone that I had. It was 
You know what I hate with some androids? Like, you know the part when sometimes when they update, they get, like, for some reason, they get into a heating stage in, in their life. Like, I noticed that with a few phone, uh, with a few phones. Mostly it was with, uh... Oh. Uh, yeah, because you know it's weird freaking, uh, that happened with... That, it happened with my Note 8 a few times. So what I did, I would take off the cover, throw the cover into the fridge so it could be nice and, uh, nice and cold. And I would put the, f the fan against the phone. And it, would get, it was in a weird heating stage. And I found that just so annoying. It had no apps running, nothing like that. Yeah, no, it's just so it's... <clears throat> What some people do, they throw their phone into the fridge. That yeah. is bad. Don't you, don't you gain... Condensation that way? I have no idea. So in other words, it fucks up the phone. I done the. <laughs> I go. I went. I went outside. I went outside. Set this up. It's, uh, when it was snowing. It's cause... It's, it's cause Gina, I don't feel the cold sometimes. Uh oh. 